Friday night, and we begin with a developing story involving a Villanova student who was sexually assaulted by an Uber driver. According to the university, the driver raped the victim last weekend inside of a residence hall. Action News reporter Sharifa Jackson is live from Villanova's campus with the full story tonight. Sharifa. Yeah, Rick, a lot of students, they were out and about for a special basketball event tonight. So we got a chance to talk to quite a few of them. As you can imagine, a lot of them are very concerned and also shocked that this happened on campus. The victim, she told police that the rape happened here at this very popular residence hall here on campus. It was it was very hard to read, I think. Yeah, it was very it was hard. Disheartening. It was just after 7 p.m. Villanova police sent out a safety alert to all students and staff. A female student told police after she was dropped off at the Commons Residence Hall complex by an Uber driver. She was then raped by that same driver. The building is located on Lancaster Avenue, a busy road dotted with dorms, fraternity houses, and restaurants. It's surprising. I would say that Villanova does a very good job of, you know, locking down the campus and making sure that students are safe. So obviously when I got that, it was a shock. Awful that it happened. Uh I'm surprised that happened here on Villanova. The university's chief of police says the assault happened during the overnight hours of September 13th and 14th. The rape was reported to police Friday. Villanova University police have since identified and contacted the Uber driver who has been banned from the university property while this matter is being investigated. The incident has also been reported to Uber. It's not something any of the students we spoke to recall happening in recent years. I would just like to also acknowledge the person who came forward. That was a really, really difficult thing to do and really brave. Um, on their behalf. This student tells me she's already taking precautions. Especially as a girl, I normally have a lot of girlfriends with me um, or some guy friends too. Just smart to not be alone. Very awful and I hope that it doesn't happen again and I don't think it will because Villanova is very good at reacting. And a spokesperson with Villanova says the university is providing the victim with all the necessary support and resources. And as far as Uber, a rep tells us that they are appalled at what happened and that they banned the driver as soon as this was reported to them. In Villanova, Sharifa Jackson, Channel 6 Action News. Rick. All right, Sharifa, thank you.